Your real estate market update for the state of Massachusetts. Hi, I'm Jeff Chubb, and I wanted to share with you a current update of what's going on along the state of Massachusetts and a couple select areas throughout Massachusetts. So let's talk about the state first. Condo. Inventory is actually up 13.72%, which is a decrease from last month where we were registering a 22.98% increase year over year. So we've seen inventory start to swing. Meanwhile, sales are down 3.35%, which continues to slide compared to last month where we saw sales at 2.62%. So inventory has gone down, but sales, they continue to go down as well. Meanwhile, prices for condos in the state of Massachusetts are actually up 4.06%. Now, the huge swing came in uh, single family with inventory down 8.13% compared to last month where we actually had increased inventory levels of 1.9%. Sales continued their decline at 0.77% year over year, and this was compared to the 0.42% that we saw last month. So sales continued to be a little bit slower in the single family market throughout the entire state. Meanwhile, prices are actually up 3.21%. So we're doing a great, great things are going on in the real estate market throughout the state of Massachusetts. So we'll move to Boston real quick, you know, the largest city in the state. Condo, condo inventory is actually up 34.87%, which is a slight pullback from the 41.84% that we saw last, uh, last month year over year. Single family inventory, just like in the state of Massachusetts, is actually now down 1.68%. And this is compared where last month we actually saw inventory up 14.29%. So we're seeing some pretty huge swings here in the state of, uh, in the city of Boston. Condo sales, meanwhile, they're down 8.36%. And this is pretty much substantially the same as last month. They were down 8.63%. Uh, single families, meanwhile, the sales are down 16.22% versus the one79 Nine percent that we saw last month so you know even though inventory is way down in the single family market throughout the city of Boston well sales are actually down a lot more so that's something that we need to keep our eye on as we continue throughout the rest of the year I figure we'll switch gears a little bit and we'll head down to Weymouth condo inventory in Weymouth is actually up 47.06 percent meanwhile sales are down 18.18 percent but prices they're still up 4.31 percent in the single family market, we actually have inventory down 9.09%. Meanwhile, sales are actually down as well, 5.93%, but prices, they're still up at 1.73%. So moving on out over to Natick, single family, for the single family market, inventory is actually up 1.75%. Now, sales are actually up 8.11%, but prices are down 0.33%. Now I know 0.33%, that's not much, but still inventory is slightly up, sales are way up, but yet prices are just down very little bit. So headed a little bit farther out, I figure we'll jump out to Worcester where inventory is actually down 54.69%, sales are down 12.44%, but yet prices are up 12.28%. In the single family market in Worcester, inventory is down 46.53%, sales are down 7.14%, but yet prices are up 8.73%. So Worcester's in really great shape. Uh, it's a little bit harder of a market if you're a buyer in, but if you're a seller in it, it, it really is a great market to be in. So I figure we'll jump up to the North Shore area. Let's choose the town of Reading. Uh, the Reading single family market, we actually have inventory up 4.17% year over year. Uh, meanwhile, sales are up 17.57% and prices are up 2.28%. Again, my name is Jeff Chubb. If you have any questions about your home or the real estate market, or if I can be of assistance in any way, I'd love to be your, uh, your source for real estate, if you will. You're always more than welcome to give us a call at 617-480-2600 or shoot me an email at jeff at boston2.com. Thanks a lot. I appreciate you watching. If you have any questions, I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day.